Okay, I will be commentating this matchup between Ooh, AZPM Saga versus Brad Warman. <laughs> Excuse my cough, guys. Well, we get underway right here. We got Cloud versus uh, Lucas. Um, well, I've never, never seen this matchup before, but um, I was playing a uh, Easy PM Saga on uh, Friendlies earlier. Um, he knows he knows the basics about a uh, Cloud. It was pretty impressive. We'll see. We'll see what he uh, learned from those Friendlies for me for my Marth. We got Cloud right here at thirty percent with a full limb break. Recently nerfed. I, I would say that's a huge, huge nerf on Cloud. I mean, especially with the, the limb break down B. Because that down B... Oh, oh we, 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 we. Not, not sure what he was thinking right there, but that, now that's a punish right here. He's got the percent lead! Just came in right here. Saga's got to be careful not to get Gimp because Lucas does have the tools to... Uh, even... Actually, he has a lot of tools. This is going to be a... Oh, I thought it was going to be a back throw, but nope. Okay, Lucas is coming in back. You've got the percentage. And then that was a nice upbeat right down to a down smash. It sends you on the opposite direction. That was actually a very smart play. I don't see that many clouds do that. I mean, like, especially when, when you're at high percentage, that much uh, awareness. I was expecting back throw, but up throw almost... Uh, it looked like he got nerfed. Anyways, um, back to the match. Lucas with a nice up smash read right there. Garn possibly going for that one frame invincibility right there. All right, we got off stage. Uh, no, no, no. Now we don't. Also, Cloud's force smash, which he caught nerfed as well. <coughs> Excuse my cough, guys. Oh my god, look at the Lucas player's uh, facial expression. It's opening his mouth a little bit. I'm, I'm just gonna stare at it, stare at him right now. He, he looks so center focused right now. He, he realized he's playing a. He's playing a good, decent cloud. Oh, he misses the down B! It looked like he was going, um, hopefully for an air dodge into the ground. But uh, Lucas was just too far out. There you go, Saga. We're, ooh, pretty even percentage right now. Back to Reed. It's always uh, Ness's and Lucas's um, players, especially when they're not really that much. Um, what to say? High tier players. They're always going to be on that ledge, and if they're Praying for a back throw. And it will come out if people just misjudge it. And we just saw that right there. I would say it's a pretty decent Lucas. I've The thing is, like, I've played two songs uh Lucas. I I'm just, I'm so sorry if you're watching this video. I've totally forgot your name. But uh from what I've seen there was like way more um aggro compared to this um, Lucas. I mean, you see mostly Nairs that would uh, counter. Those uh, side Bs, I do believe, are called PK Fire. He would trap you uh, using a, a PK Fire going in, shield, and then a shield, shield grab, waiting for an opponent to attack them. <coughs> and then he gets instant momentum right there if <coughs> they fall for a trap. <coughs> but uh, I don't see uh, Brad Mo Romance doing this. Uh, using down B to suck up Cloud's neutral B. Oh, we got it. Uh, 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 uh oh. Uh oh. Uh, Saga's got a got a lot of catching up right here. This is his counter pick. It looks like we got Cyber Saw uh, coming right here <coughs> uh, into a commentary. High percentage right here. Oh, I was surprised. No back here. And there's those nares I was talking about earlier. There's like actually a true combo right into lower percentage. All right, I so think. What, so what do we got here? We have Saga versus Brad Romance. Uh, Brad Romance is up by a stock. Uh, Saga's uh, having a really hard time getting the stock out. 
and I think it's getting in his head. Well, really, a, real, a really good up air will take it or a dash attack. Almost. You see, I thought he would have it right there, but yeah. like I'm, I'm seeing like more nerfs from uh from Cloud, and I'm kind of surprised about it. Yeah, and finishing touch is uh, nerfed as well, mm -hmm. and expecting to roll right there. It looks like. He's just not falling for it. Yeah. Or he has to get rid of the stock now because he has full rage right now. Oh, that was, that, that was a good. And that's uh, either. Yeah. Oh, that's gonna be it. Sixty-eight percent. Technically, anything would have killed right there. Yeah. But surprising dash attack didn't kill. I mean, probably was still. We'll Down the throw oh. to Nair. Two, up, oh. He's going oh, for the hard no. reads. That had a hitbox back there. I know. That's crazy. I never knew that. It's like, like, right behind him. It's not like, it's not too big. But, um, okay. you just don't check. He's probably. Uh, Tio should be. Uh, either up behind us or on this side over there. Yeah. Brad, Brad Romance yeah. looked like he was pretty hyped. Okay, where's the Tio? Where's the Tio? I got, I got, I got, I got to win. I got to win. That was interesting. Oh yeah, come closer right here over here so we can see yeah. you. Uh. Hello. Hello. We actually have three people here. You see the person in the back. We very happy. She, very happy. I wish she was in Smash Brothers. Just I kidding. wish too. <laughs> That'd be pretty awesome. We need someone cute on there. Anyways, uh, as you can see, that ticker on the top right corner of your screen, we have Coco defeats Kerblam. 2-0. Kerblam. Sounds Kerblam. new. Yeah. UCLA. Hey, there's a guy sponsored by UCLA. Hey, Billy Yeezy. All right, he defeats Sirius 2-0. Oh, what did he play? Sirius? I think, I don't know who Sirius plays exactly. Hmm. Hey, look, it's you. Cyrus defeats Clockstar 2-0. Hey. Hey. Oh, and everybody in the bottom right hand screen, we got people buying drinks. Yeah, people, yes. We have, we have a, bar, a bar at work. This is called a barcade, guys. Barcade? Yes. Technically, it's called a barcade. But there's like only like a few um, like arcade machines here. Oh, yeah. But, anyways, um, we're just enjoying uh, the last. So, who's probably next? We have no idea. It's probably up to the TO. Yeah. But we are also enjoying the last days of Ben Game now. Oh. When is it closing? May? May. May. Oh, okay. Not that far off. It's a shame. It really is a like very, this place. It is a very likable place. I mean, um, from what we heard, um, moving to a new place? No. Oh, I gotta go fight SS. Wish me luck. Okay, I would definitely wish you luck. Make sure you know your spacing game. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> We should have Saga on stream with me. So this matchup will be in two minutes. We're getting uh, SS, uh, who happens to be the number one player here in AZ, also called the Supreme Champion in our PR. We have a total of 10 people in the PR. Um, unless you're in SoCal, you get 20. Today should be uh, pretty hype. Um, I didn't know Shane was going to come, but this is a very, for excellent, excellent presence right here for Shane and a great presence for here at Endgame. Like we said before, it is closing down. We don't know what, actually we do know why they're closing down, but it is a sad entity and also a presence here as well because you normally, um, I would see more people here, but like now that it's out there, we just gotta hope some prayers for Endgame. Hopefully for their manager as well. Hopefully they do better. Up. But we have uh, Shane versus uh, Cyrus, who is going to link. Um, I'm not sure Shane's familiar with this uh, matchup here in Smash Four. I do know Shane does play Toon Link in uh, PM. Shane also uh, a member of the PR as well in uh, Project M. So let's see if uh, any of the matchup experiences from that game carries over. We'll see. Cyrus is doing an excellent, excellent job spacing. 
Getting a uh, Ness right there, right there. Oi! Air dodge. That was like a perfect setup by Shane. Um, using the up B. But it looks like Cyprus wanted to go tech. But he was way too high. And that was just a free forward smash right there from Ness. I'm not even sure if you could uh, down B that. Especially when the uh, Toon Link Storm bombs. Oh, okay. I, I guess that works. <laughs> I should ask Cyrus why he uses Moon River as a as a tag. But anyways, we got a hype match right here. The number one player versus Cyrus, and that's a back throw. It wasn't stale at all. But that was excellent, DIBSS. I was going for the hard read right there, but Shane's just like, I'm just going to hold my shield and just die. All right, 41% to zero. Uh, this is uh, anyone's game right here. Cybris, uh realizing um, he is up against the number one player. He should go in confident, saying that he could do this. This is very manageable right here. Getting Shane down to his uh, last stock right now in this two-stock game. Going for the down smash. I know he does that all the time. Because just even if you're gonna roll down, I'm just gonna down smash you. This is a back throw. No, not just not gonna get it. Oh, that bomb just came out of nowhere. And that's just gonna do it. I don't uh, Sheen. Um, <laughs> you don't want to roll, especially. When you're at high percentage like that, because that's almost a free game. It almost looks like that Shane is looking for that. And then again, he is playing Ness, and the back throw is your greatest, uh, your greatest uh, tool right here in Smash Four. All right, going on to game two. We are going to town and city. So, um, I would not uh, pick the stage because the blast zone for town and city, I would say. Uh, benefits the throws for Ness. But uh, let's see if Cyrus has a, a game change plan. He's got that 9% lead right here. Ooh, got the back here. <coughs> oh, I was expecting a jab. He went for... Uh-oh. Uh, uh for their strings. Right into a PK fire to Dare. That was a very scary situation for Cybers right there. Um, Ness was highly vulnerable. I mean, like, I wasn't sure if uh, Toon Link had a bomb. He could just throw it right out there. Could, could possibly cancel that PK Thunder. It does! Oh my god, bomb cancels PK Thunder. Just like Yoshi's egg. You could do that off stage. Uh oh! We have an HDMI problem. Well, that's fine. We're back. All right. So as this is cotton on to Cyrus is a little bit of habits. He's got a stock lead right here. I think he's just waiting for the right opportunity just to come in. Oh, there's that down smash. Like I said before, he goes in for that. Oi! The bomb just came out and over. It just hit that little kid's head. Try and go for the hardest reads. A throw might... No, no, no. Almost. Shane's like, I, I just want to move on, you know? And that's how you're going to move on. The bomb right into up A. 